Hi, I'm Dean Groovy from Knife Tech NZ, and thanks for buying our filleting DVD. This is a step-by-step -step instructional video on how to fillet, skin and bone, and other techniques used to prepare a selection of fish species. This is the lemon sole. We're going to skin it by hand. So to skin it by hand, we just put a cut in by the head, turn it on its edge, make a cut like that, you can turn it over and make another cut on that side. Take a hand steel, put the hand steel, hand steel in there so you can get a hand hold, poke your steel all the way through to the tail and bring it out. Don't come out too far because what can happen is that when you go to tear it back, if you've gone under here, you'll actually pull that centerpiece out. So when you fillet it, you'll end up splitting the fillet. This is a good size rig. It has like a centre line. And if we end up cutting either side of that centre line, we will end up leaving skin on the fillet, which we'll need to trim off later. We'll just make sure the fish stays where we want it to. By moving your hand to where your knife is, then you're not trying to cut and stretch the fish and, and it keeps the full control of where you want it to be. So by putting a knife in, once again it's on an angle, blades pointing up, and the back of the knife's putting the pressure on the fillet, that'll stop that from losing that recovery. Get yourself a, a hand hold with a skin, bring it to the edge of the board, get a good firm grip on the skin, and we're going to push away and then as we get to the end of the fish we need to keep that momentum going. You have a gurnard. A gurnard is a relatively simple fish to fillet. We lift the wing up and you've got a spike right on the edge here. This is a dangerous wee spike. So what we do, hold the head to avoid getting yourself spiked. Take the back of your knife and run your back of your knife up the fish until you hit the spike. So it runs under the fin to the spike that you can see. Turn it over and then make a cut in. Here I've taken this fish and you'll see I've pushed it flat so that that's against that. So when I actually cut it, I can actually follow, follow the roll. So I've, I've pushed that flat against the board, come in, rolled, now on this side, come in and come under it. I'm not going to cut right through again. I'm going to put my knife in there, hold that like this, and there's your lining just to help with your presentation. When I turn it over, you can see how basically that whole lining's gone. I'd love to get your feedback and photos on the success of your next prepared catch. If you'd like to see anything on the up and coming DVDs, please let me know. You can get our details off the screen now or from the back of the DVD case. <laughs>